I'll go back to Kailani, like uh, the way Mr. Hader was saying that you'd be having a performance. So I'd like to know how long have you been uh, acting or writing? Or being a mother, being a mother is a uh, different <laughs> thing, but how long have you been <laughs> acting and writing? I started um, when I was 19, a long time ago. Long time ago. Ah, acting. Beautiful days in 19. I, I just um, I started writing more recently, mm -hmm. okay. but I had a very full career as an actress on Broadway and films, television, and uh, later started writing my own work of stories oh. I wanted to be told. So oh, that's really amazing. That's where the writing comes from. Okay, that's really amazing. Uh, like the way Mr. Hader was saying that uh, we were planning to exchange the culture. I'd like to know from your part as well, how do you see it, like exchange of culture, mi uh, mixing up things together? Well, no one in America knows anything about Bangladesh. Mm -hmm. And I was offered this fellowship to travel anywhere in Asia, and I chose Bangladesh. And... Uh, I want to bring American stories to you mm -hmm. and I want to take the Bangladeshi stories back to America. So I've, I've um, set up meetings with people at the schools, the universities, the theaters, uh, the, th throughout the country, but mostly throughout Dhaka to um, hear the stories and when I'm talking to students to encourage them to tell their stories mm -hmm. because I think um, one of the things you learn as a theater person is the importance of storytelling and the stories that I tell are stories that have been forgotten and so to empower people whether it's in um, the government whether it's in um, the workers whether it's students to be brave enough to tell the stories of their culture and their time it, we are, we're a global world right now, and all we really do globally is economics. So as an artist, I want to do global culture. Amazing. Okay. That's, that's, my, that's my goal, to be here. Okay. Uh, and everybody has been fabulously warm <laughs> and welcoming. I, it's unbelievable. Okay, come to Yuli. What are you going to perform on 31st? Uh, a play called Can't Scare Me, the story of Mother Jones. Okay. And I think that's why uh, Botala is so interested in me <laughs> because we had something in the U.S. happen as, in all of the West. The bottom fell out of the market and people, the working people, middle class people struggled with mm -hmm. jobs. Mm -hmm. And I wrote this play about the history of American labor and it it makes sense with what is going on in Bangladesh today. It's, okay. uh, it's very similar, something we went through and something that you, you are going through. But again, it's stories, real true stories of, um, okay. that empower us. Um, so I'm, this play is, uh, is about the American labor movement, mm -hmm. and, okay, okay. Um, but it's, it parallels, I think, what's going on in Bangladesh. Okay, so it's a completely historic play. Completely. Okay. Everything is accurate. Okay. Uh, I would like to know another thing. Like, uh, as we were saying that uh, we are trying our best to draw as many as viewers that we can to the th theaters. I really would like to know what's the condition in the United States like? Uh, what's the responses? To to the play or to right. theater to, the play, or to this to play theater. Audience. to theater to theater to in general theater in general. Yeah, oh, in general well it's uh, to Broadway like to our film industry mm -hmm. it's very big it's everything yeah. is sold yes. out right. to uh, regional theaters if mm -hmm. they're well known it's sold out if to new productions they have to catch an audience they have mm -hmm. to either sometimes because they are beautiful sometimes because they are political some but it's, you know it's very hard for a new play I was very lucky with this play the Mother Jones play um, that it it struck Clicked. a chord and um, and same with my last play because as I said I'm not a playwright by origin but I I took little tiny garnets of truth and put a light on them and mm -hmm. uh, people recognized the the truth in it and so all of a sudden my plays are being done um but but i think i think theater is quite popular i mean television's more popular it's easier <laughs> yeah, you, just turn it on. you don't just turn it on you don't have to travel <laughs> you have a history of theater and art in this country yeah. and it would be a shame to lose it because of traffic
I mean, no. <laughs> I mean, take, no, we, take, are not, we are not losing it. <laughs> but take the sure. theater on a truck to the people, then, yeah. you know, if, if they can't get to the theater in time. Because, Hopefully, I mean, everything we won't lose it. No, we, need it. we have yeah. accommodated yeah. ourselves in such a way that we, uh, traffic doesn't affect us. Oh, that yeah. Congratulations and Thank all you. the best you. for your play. Thank Hopefully, you. we will come and join. <laughs> Hopefully Bangladesh would be such an experience in your life that you'll fall in love with the people here. Yeah. I will. I've already asked for a fellowship to come back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's an amazing oh, thing. Amazing. That's right. an amazing thing. Thank After you. that, do you join